Joe is certainly a sensitive guy. He's uh, very passionate, and uh, you know, it's really well written. Uh, I think it comes from from the writers and, and all of that. And I'm very fortunate to have that character to portray. And uh, you know, it's something that uh, the relationship I think with Meredith and Derek that really. Uh, um, speaks to people, and uh, I'm very fortunate to be a part of that, and uh, to be a part of that projection, and, and, uh, and play that character. I guess it's turned out to be a bit of a cliffhanger, so you're going to see uh, uh, one relation ending and one beginning. Uh, probably being an actor in L.A. Uh, <laughs> being an actor in L.A. is far more dangerous than racing, certainly. Well, certainly, uh, Derek Shepard's a great character to play. Uh, the power of television is phenomenal, and to, to benefit from that, from a response of a, a hit TV show has changed my life profoundly, and I'll forever be grateful for, you know, ABC and Shonda Rhimes for giving me that opportunity and changing my life uh, and allowing me to do things like this, and also opportunities to go off and do movies. And, and uh, fortunately, we had a, a great, uh, you know, response to Enchanted as well. It's been doing quite well, and, uh, you know, um, I, I think the... Certainly, uh, Can't Buy Me Love was a, a movie that changed my life uh, early on, and some other things as well. I, I, I also liked, uh, once and again, uh, that was a great character for me that changed uh, the first part of my career and, and sort of opened the door to the second part of my career that I'm currently experiencing. I know, uh, well, I have a movie coming out in May, Maid of Honor, uh, with uh, Michelle Monaghan, which I'm really excited about. It's a nice romantic comedy. Uh, we shot it in New York and uh, Scotland and England and had a great time.